Hello, and welcome to the OpenText Imaging for Windows installation tutorial. When installing Imaging for Windows 4.0, the first thing that you'll need to do is insert the disk into the CD-ROM. If the program doesn't automatically start like this, open an Explorer window, find the drive where you put the CD, and look for Imaging for Windows 4.0. If you're not viewing file extensions, as shown here, it will say Windows Installer Package. If you downloaded the application, you'll need to unzip the downloaded file. Once you find the unzipped folder, it'll look just like the one pictured here. Once the program starts, it will begin the installation process. Now that the installation process has begun, the first screen that will pop up is the welcome screen. This screen confirms that you're installing OpenText Imaging for Windows 4.0. Click on the Next here to continue. After that is the License screen. Read the license carefully. Once you've read the license, you'll need to click the Accept Radio button to continue the installation. Clicking I Do Not Accept will prevent you from continuing the installation process. Once you've clicked the I Accept, click Next to continue the installation. The next screen will allow you to install the program in another location if you choose. By default, it will install to the Program Files Global 360 directory. Once you've picked an installation directory, or if you chose the default location, click Next. On the next screen, you'll be given the option to install the software in a typical or custom fashion. Choosing the typical option gives you the full installation, and the custom option only allows you the option of not installing certain parts of the package. Once you've made your choice, click Next. If you choose the typical option, the last screen before the installation process begins allows you to confirm all the information you've entered so far. If you see anything that doesn't look right, click the Back button to correct it. Otherwise, click Next. During the install process, you may see a screen that looks like this, that allows you to enter the serial number. Entering the serial number here will not prevent you from having to enter it again later. This is just a check. You can leave the serial number blank and continue on with the installation. At this point, click Install. The installation process will take a minute or two, depending on the speed of your machine. Do not restart your machine during this process. If you're using Windows 7 or Windows Vista, you may get a pop-up window requesting elevated permissions to install the program. If you get this, please click Continue to complete the installation. Finally, you'll get to the last screen of the installation process. This screen confirms that you have successfully installed OpenText Imaging for Windows 4.0. To complete the process, simply click Finish. You have now completely installed Imaging for Windows 4.0. If you have any problems with this installation, please send an email to i4wquestions at opentext.com. Before you can use the software, you'll need to register it, and to learn more about that process, please view our registration tutorial video. Thank you.